Hi, my name is Jennifer and I'm a library assistant at the North Columbus Public Library and today we are going to be meteorologists. So meteorologists, they watch the weather. So the first thing we're going to do is a craft so we can keep track of the weather. So what you're going to need is some paper, some markers or colored pencils, some scissors, and some cotton balls. So we're going to make a weather chart. So what you're going to do is you are going to take your piece of paper and you're going to draw four sections on it using your marker or a pen or a sharpie. So you have it divided in four. Then what you're going to do is you're going to draw four different types of weather. So for mine, I use the cotton balls to make cloudy. If you don't have any, don't worry. You can just draw on some clouds. Um, I have a sun for sunny, an umbrella for rainy, and a hat and a scarf for cold. You can also cut some yarn off and use tape so you can hang it on a door or on the wall, anywhere you want. Then you're going to need a paper clip or a binder clip, something so when you get up in the morning you can look outside and you can take your clip and say, it's sunny today, and you can mark it. So that's step one of being a meteorologist. Then what you're going to do is you're going to make a chart like this. And you're going to put down the date. And you're going to put down what kind of weather it is. So for example, today is May 22nd. And the weather is sunny. So there's the first line on my chart. If you want to, you can get even fancier by keeping track of the weather and then writing down what you predict the weather might be. For example, if it's sunny all week this week, then maybe you can write down that you predict it's going to be sunny and then write down whether you were right or wrong. So. I hope you had fun today making your craft and logging your weather. I hope you keep logging your weather and you start making predictions of your own like a real meteorologist. Bye! We are springing into summer learning at the Chattahoochee Valley Libraries and the program you just attended is one of the ways you can earn completions. Just go to cvlga.org and look for Spring into Summer Learning. You can register yourself and your family online and then start reading and attending our online events. That's all you have to do. We're giving away weekly gift certificates and every completion you make enters you into a grand prize drawing for tablets, games, gifts, and more. Remember, you have to register to win cvlga.org, and we'll see you online again real soon.